Hello to everybody and their moms and welcome back to another episode of Exposed. Today, we are testing toothpaste, but not just any sort of toothpaste, teeth whitening toothpaste from none other than Crest. On the real, um, I've been wanting to try this for a fat minute. I say that all the time, but like genuinely, like the fattest minute yet. Like minute and like, she's thick. Like it's been the longest time. And I literally was like, oh my gosh, I have no excuse. So I went and risked it for the biscuit for you guys. I went out and battled a storm. I battled COVID-19 directly. She swung and I dodged. And somehow I survived. I made it into Walmart and I found the toothpaste and by the grace of God I'm here. No, but actually here is Miss Crest 3D White Whitening Therapy Deep Clean Charcoal Toothpaste. Am I a YouTuber yet? Did I do it correctly? Ooh, she's got one of them like fun little tubes, you know what I'm saying? Like the little bottom. Why do I really have to be a YouTuber the whole time? This is bonkers. Oh, maybe this is their way of saying that that's how white my teeth are gonna be. It says that it's an invigorating mint flavor, so that should be fun. Oh. It literally smells like my cold cake. I don't know why I was expecting it to have some like earthy scent, but it's not bad. Um, and the toothpaste itself has like, can y'all see that? It has like a hint of black. Um, according to the directions, it says that you're supposed to take a pea sized amount and like put it on your toothbrush and then obviously brush your teeth. Duh. And so I went to their website and it said that it's supposed to take two to three days to see results but because i'm nice <laughs> you're welcome i'm going to test it for five days and then obviously if it works then i'm going to just keep using it it'll be my new ride or die toothpaste and i'm going to use it tonight so essentially what i'm going to do is i'm going to check in with you guys every single morning and every single evening because i'm going to brush my teeth twice a day if you have been doing that <laughs> here's your sign to do that so i'm going to do that um, and I'm also going to take a before shot of my teeth, which is going to be very embarrassing because I feel like, no ma'am, this is the whole point of expose. Um, part of it is, I guess, exposing myself. So <laughs> I will show you guys my teeth so we can see a clear difference before and after. Um, and I'm really excited. So let's give this a try. It said two to three days, so that clearly can't be correct. I don't know. One thing I will say, this toothpaste tastes disgusting. It says invigorating mint. Excuse me, could y'all have added more mint? <laughs> Cause that <laughs> flavor was lacking. I mean, it's not like you're trying to eat the bottle, but like also there was that earthy flavor that I knew I was going to taste, so tragic. But um. Yeah, I guess it's not bad, it's just toothpaste, so I guess we'll have more accurate results on day two or day three. Okay, I forgot to do it yesterday, um, and don't mind me, I'm gonna put a little bit of Carmex on because I don't like having chapped lips. But looking at my teeth, I feel like I have been able to see a difference. Um, but the only thing is, is that I feel like it wears off, if that makes sense. Like the brightness, like what you're seeing now, it looks good, <laughs> it looks good. But then like later on in the day, it's just like, 
not looking the same i feel like y'all saw that before she was looking a little tinted a little yellow but i feel like now it still kind of looks a little yellow to me but then when i get up and look in a different setting it looks white so i don't really know but we're gonna keep going because like i said five days Okay, so I got ready for the day, um, but I did want to make sure I documented the fact that this is the last day. Obviously, I'm gonna keep brushing my teeth after this, but it's the last day that we're trying um, this toothpaste. It's still too bright. Um, normally, I would show you guys my teeth, but I'm gonna wait till the very end of the day so we can really see as a whole um, what it looks like. And yeah, that's basically it. I'm excited and I'll see y'all later. So I'm back. It has been a extremely long day, um, but we're gonna brush our teeth one last time for the sake of this video. Um, again, not stopping brushing my teeth forever because why? Why? <laughs> why? 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 Um, so I'm gonna brush my teeth real fast, and then I'm gonna give you guys the final verdict and all the information about this toothpaste. So let's talk final thoughts. I wanted to get my laptop so I could provide you guys with all of the exact information um, about this toothpaste, which by exact information, I mean the price. <laughs> and then I'm just gonna give you guys the whole rundown like I always do and we'll figure out if it is exposed or not. So this toothpaste happened to retail for $6.97 at Walmart. With tax, it came out to be like seven and change, um, but Overall, um, not a bad price point. However, you can get two bottles of this for $6.96. So essentially what you could get two of these, the same price as one of these. Um, the difference is this one is deep clean and you know, it's supposed to make your teeth whiter. Now, initially when I started this toothpaste, I think you guys all saw in the beginning, I was like, this is disgusting. But the more and more I used it, I just got so used to it. Like it literally just is normal. Like it's normal. Like if you wanted to go get and try it, like the flavor is not different than anything else. I was just being dramatic, which is not new, but I think I was just caught off guard for the first day, but you, you really do get used to it. I feel like I've talked enough and I really want to just give the verdict. On the case of the Crest 3D Light Charcoal Toothpaste versus Kristen. Crest. not expecting that one neither was i <laughs> crest has not been exposed and i'm gonna tell you why so the price so the price point i think that a whitening toothpaste under ten dollars is actually a really good deal you get a lot um you only have to use a little bit like a little pea size um so this is gonna last me a long time um if i pinch this like literally i still have all of this left um which is a pretty good amount if you ask me i think it's a pretty decent amount of toothpaste left but i think all price aside i think that the big thing for me is that i actually visibly see a difference i'm gonna put the before video and the after video so y'all can clearly see the difference and i really do see a difference in my teeth i feel like my gums look a lot healthier I feel like when I smile, like it just looks a little bit whiter. It's not like shining, okay? But it's definitely like a difference that if I feel like I keep using it on a regular basis like I am, that it's gonna be even more and more visible. I also like it because you don't have to put, you know, strips on your teeth. This is just a toothpaste, so it's nothing that's irregular out of what you already do. And I felt like, I don't know it kind of like boosted my confidence <laughs> but overall i would definitely recommend it and if you happen to use it please 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 let me know 
So if you happen to enjoy this episode of Exposed, please give it a thumbs up. I have a bunch of other episodes in this series, um, but also please subscribe to my channel. Um, I have a weekly subscriber goal, so I'm gonna put it on the screen. And I mean, if you could help me, that'd be really nice and I would really appreciate it. But thank you guys so much for watching and come back in a couple weeks to see who Exposed next. Court is adjourned.